And I think this is definitely going to take our opponent out. There's no way he can stop this trick. And they're going to go my mini pack. Wow, that was really well played by our opponent. And we get a mini pack a hit. Maybe a second hit. Oh, that's going to be real juice. Actually, I don't know how we're going to defend this, to be honest. Y'all see me fly and never drop down. Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. So quickly before playing into any of these games, just want to give a special shout out to all of you guys for 100 subs. I actually just checked this morning and I saw 100 subs and that's pretty insane for me. So definitely want to give a special shout out to all my subs and all my viewers. So hopping into this video, um, playing against Maestro here. Um, he's got Valkyrie, so we did get a charge shot and an extra... Um, hit from the uh, Ram Rider, so definitely you would take that, and I think the bats, w even with the zap, is not going to get a hit on the tower, so that's really solid. Probably going to start um, splitting wall breakers to apply some pressure, and if he goes with the Hog Rider, I'm going to go guards right here. Definitely wish I have my um, mini P.E.K.K.A. That's alright, so we get a hit on the right, so definitely with this deck, um, if you end up having split lane pressure you can go either way so we're gonna go ram rider here let's see what he does on the left side um so he's got tesla so definitely a bit annoying but we want to save our mini pekka for the hog rider so we're gonna go with magic archer in the back and this deck is the deck that carried me last season all the way up to league 10 so definitely be trying to do that um, again this season and he has Fireball in his deck, so I'm going to go with Mega Knight in the back. Typically, you don't want to use Mega Knight um, as uh, even just dropping it in the back. You want it to act as a defense, and then you have a counter push capabilities with it. But um, because of our hand, we definitely wanted to keep our uh, Snowball and our uh, Mini P.E.K.K.A. for his Hog Rider. That would definitely be coming down the lane right now. So I'm going to go with Road Delivery right here. And gonna go mini P.E.K.K.A. And then gonna go bats, right? Here. Um, trying to snowball for the bats. And then I think that should... Okay, so it forces out a zap, so I'll definitely take it. Um, so we're a little bit behind now. But that's okay. We're gonna go uh, Ram Rider. We're gonna go Wall Breakers right behind it. I think one Wall Breaker might make a connection. Okay, no. So we'll take a Ram Rider charge um, any day of the week. So we're gonna get a road delivery set up right here. And then we're gonna go uh, Mega Knight. And Mega Knight will bounce back the... Uh, hog Rider, and we'll go Giant Snowball to knock back the Hog Rider, but it still gets another hit, which is pretty crazy. I'm gonna go Ram Rider right behind the uh, uh, Mega Knight, and I think we should be pretty good here. I don't know what he's gonna do to be able to counter this. A Wall Breaker's gonna break through still and force out the Fireball, so that's pretty good. I don't think the Ram Rider's gonna make it through. That's okay. We're gonna get um, our Mini Pekka ready for his uh, Hog Rider, but he doesn't drop, so I'm gonna go uh, Mega Knight in the back here and get geared up again for another defense so he doesn't have fireball so we can definitely play magic archer in the back pretty safely i'm gonna go mega knight and uh mini pekka that should be able to uh, take that out pretty easily and he was able to cycle back to a fireball but we have quite a bit coming down the lane right here and i think this is definitely going to take our opponent out there's no way he can stop this right that's going to be towered down with the mini pekka taking that out so even though that game was sus the entire time and we were playing from behind we definitely definitely made a comeback with um one massive push right there as you guys just saw all righty hopping into another one here against brandon he's got three z's after his name so i wonder if he's gonna be a little sleepy playing into this game here so let's see what he starts off with we don't have a great starting hand so if he goes with baby dragon it makes me think graveyard um maybe lava hound but realistically i don't see a lot of lava hounds being played anymore so I'm going to go guard right here, and I'm going to go uh, row delivery for his mini P.E.K.K.A. And I'm going to go my mini P.E.K.K.A. Wow, that was really well played by our opponent. Um, that rage really sped things up. So we're going to go balls to the wall right here. Um, I think that's going to... Uh, is that going to counter the wall breaker? No, and we get a mini P.E.K.K.A. hit. Maybe a second hit. Oh, that's going to be real juicy right there. So we do have to defend this somehow. Actually, I don't know how we're going to defend this, to be honest. Let's see, we're gonna go uh, Magic Archer, and wow, so it's not a, it's not what I thought it was actually, um, because we have Elixir Golem, and Baby Dragon, and Deidre, okay, 
So we'll definitely let him take our tower right here. Um, there's not much um, in trying to defend this. I will go uh, Mega Knight right now to take care of the blobs and the uh, battle healer. So we're definitely, definitely down. Um, but at least now we know uh, what he has. Because I would have thought he had Graveyard with the Baby Dragon. So I'm going to go Ram Rider and Wall Breakers on the right. And let's see what he drops. He drops Mega uh, Mini Pekka too on that left side. So that's definitely going to be really good for us. We're going to take most of that tower on the right as well. So we got to take out his Mini Pekka first. And then we're going to go with... Uh, let's see... I'm gonna go with Magic Archer right here to take out the E Dragon. And he has. Okay, our King Tower is taking a big, big punishment. Um, but I think we can hopefully hold hold on to that and take both towers. And I think we'll be pretty good. So I completely forgot to play uh, cards and leave a little bit of Elixir. Not the worst thing. But we're gonna go Ram Rider right here. And Ram Rider should be able to take out that Baby Dragon for us. I'm gonna go Wall Breakers here on the right as well. And let's see what else can we do. We're gonna go uh, split guards right here, and one wall breaker still makes it through on the left. Pretty wild. Um, and let's see, he's got double dragons coming down the lane on the left, so we definitely want to take that out with the road delivery. And um, we're gonna go wall breakers and ram rider here. So definitely a bit um, over committing right there, but I just wanted to be sure. Now that could be a questionable uh, judgment uh, judgment call, but. I think this should be okay. We're going to go uh, Mega Knight right here. And hopefully we're able to stop this. Those globs are really going to do a ton of damage. But I think we should be okay here. Mega Knight's going to take out the uh, Battle Healer for us. And then we should have pretty decent push coming down the lane right here. And then I need to line up uh, the shots though. So Magic Archer should be able to line up with the... I completely missed my geometry right there. Come on. We, we really, we really got to break through. One wall, break, one wall breaker breaks through and I can hardly speak and we end up beating this nasty, disgusting e-golem deck. Super stoked about that and we'll hop onto another one to end the video. Alright, jumping into this last battle here, uh, playing against a Hog Rider deck. Mini Pekka should be able to one-shot the Hog Rider. Um, so he's got Phoenix, I think, yeah, so he, he had to play something else. Gonna drop Mega Knight right here. Um, I think the Phoenix should be targeted by the tower, so that would be really good for us. So it's gonna force out some more Elixir, let's see what he drops. So he drops uh, Mini Pekka, so that's pretty solid. And the tower should finish off the egg. And then we're gonna go uh, wall breakers to pull the mini pekka back just in case. I don't think we needed it, but just in case. And wall breakers will connect for two hits. That's really solid. Um, I'm gonna go with giant snowball here just so I don't leak too much elixir. And let's see what he's got. So he's got Valkyrie, mini pekka, and Phoenix. So I'm gonna drop Ram Rider. And let's see what he drops here. Any buildings? I think he just quit. Okay. Uh, or he disconnected, so I'll definitely take that. And that right there is a three crown ton of gold, actually, that we got for um, Slash Royale. So super stoked about that. So as you can see, three wins in a row with this deck. Carried me last season. I'm probably going to be using this uh, deck to carry me this season as well. Um, none of the cards uh, that I use in this deck, the Ram Rider, the Mega Knight, the Wall Breakers, Magic Archer, Mini Pekka, none of them got a nerf in the most recent um, balance changes so it i believe it's still going to be super uh, viable in this meta if you guys like this video please like comment subscribe for more and i'll see you next time